China's newest mega bridge shocked the United States. The recently opened Hong Kong Zhohai Macau Bridge has generated world. The bridge isn't only impressive in terms of its length and size, but also in its design. It's a cable-stayed bridge, which means it's supported by cables that are anchored to towers. The bridge is made up of two main sections: a 29.6 kilometer long bridge and a 6.7 kilometer long tunnel. The tunnel goes under the sea while the bridge spans it. The entire project cost over 20 million dollars, making it one of the most expensive infrastructure projects ever built. The bridge officially opened in October 2018, and it was hailed as a major achievement for China. The opening ceremony was attended by high-ranking officials from China, Hong Kong, and Macau, and it was broadcast live on national TV. The bridge was seen as a symbol of China's economic and technological prowess, and it was celebrated as a new landmark for the region. Since its opening, the bridge has been a popular tourist attraction, with many visitors coming from all over the world to see it. The bridge is not only functional but also visually stunning, especially at night when it's lit up with thousands of LED lights. However, not everyone is impressed with this bridge. The United States, in particular, has been critical of China's infrastructure projects, including the Hong Kong Zhohai Macau Bridge. The U.S. has accused China of using its economic power to gain influence in the region and engaging in unfair trade practices. The trade war between the two countries has intensified in recent years, with both sides imposing tariffs on each other's goods. Certain U.S. politicians have voiced their concerns regarding the use of Chinese-made products in the construction of the Hong Kong Zhohai Macau Bridge. These individuals have suggested boycotting Chinese products altogether, citing the Chinese government's track record of human rights violations and perceived threat to global security. Their argument is that purchasing Chinese-made products indirectly supports an authoritarian regime that engages in activities that aren't in line with democratic values. This has sparked debates about the ethics of sourcing materials and products from countries with different political and social systems, and raises questions about the roles of consumers in promoting human rights and social justice. Despite the criticism, the Hong Kong Zhohai Macau Bridge remains an impressive feat of engineering that showcases China's technological advancement. The bridge has reduced travel time between the three cities from several hours to just 30 minutes, making it easier for people and goods to move around. It's a testament to what can be achieved when governments invest in infrastructure projects and work towards improving their country's connectivity and transportation systems. The Hong Kong Zhohai Macau Bridge is just one of the many impressive infrastructure projects that China has undertaken in recent years. From high-speed railways to mega airports and massive dams, China has been investing heavily in infrastructure to support its growing economy and population. These products not only improve connectivity and transportation, but also create jobs and stimulate economic growth. So there you have it: the Hong Kong Zhohai Macau Bridge, China's newest mega bridge that's shocking the United States and the world. While there may be some controversy surrounding China's infrastructure projects, there's no denying the incredible engineering achievements that have been made. Infrastructure investments can have a significant impact on a country's economy, society, and environment. Learning from China's experience in this area can provide valuable insights for other countries. So, what do you think of this bridge and China's infrastructure projects? What lessons can other countries learn from China's infrastructure investments, both in terms, both in terms of successes and potential mistakes as failures? Let us know in the comments down below. Thanks a lot for watching, and we'll see you again in the next video.